it's my birthday and I'm trying indoor skydiving for the very first time. I'm super excited. As you know, I do parkour and free running, so this is gonna be really interesting to see how your body moves with the air in this kind of environment, which is completely different because it doesn't rely on how strong you jump or how much energy you use, but all about how relaxed you are and how you position yourself to take advantage of the natural elements. It's so interesting how you can find a teacher, you can find a classroom in pretty much any activity you engage in. And there's a few things that I learned inside that wind tunnel that I would really like to share. See, once you step into that wind tunnel, the forces that are applying to you are applying to everybody else, right? So the wind isn't hitting you or anybody else any harder or any softer. It isn't coming from one angle or another. Everything that happens to you inside that wind tunnel is because of something that you responded to. So that wind is coming at you from below and then depending on if you just move your body slightly, you'll bank to the right. You move slightly this way, you bank to the left. You go concave and your body starts to rise. You go convex and your body sinks to the floor. Now, if you smacked into the window or you hit the floor hard or anything, you could say that, oh, that's life, it's unfair. Life is coming at me and life pushed me in this direction, pushed me in that direction. But when you step into like a wind tunnel like this, you realize that it's actually just responding to you. So in life, if you feel like you're hitting a wall, what reaction, what response are you taking in your body and your thoughts and your emotions that's causing you to find that wall and smack into it. If you find that everything is smooth sailing and you're just raising up and up, that's coming because of you as well. So rather than seeing life as coming at you and happening to you, think of life as coming through you, coming from you and happening for you. So when you see that life is basically just one big wind tunnel with all of the elements coming at you and how you respond will determine whether you float or sink, or smack into a wall, or just fly.